Orion Nebula, one of the most beautiful, most photographed regions of the sky, may also be home to dozens of planet-forming stars. Over the past few years, astronomers using the Hubble Space Telescope have surveyed Orion and the stars and gas clouds within it, finding young stars so early in their formation that they're still surrounded by disks of leftover debris. Now, they think they have evidence that the first steps of planet birth have started, but these early results seem to be a mixed bag. On the one hand, we have these situations where disks are, are observed and are capable of forming planets, yet they don't have much time to make the gas giant planets. Yet at the same time, these same disks, we see that the process of beginning to form solid bodies is already well underway. And so it's sort of a good news, bad news situation. The good news is that, wow, here are disks which can form planets and we can see the process already beginning. The bad news is you do better do it fast because otherwise you're not going to have enough time to gather the gas. That gas is needed to form gas giant planets such as Saturn and Jupiter. In Orion, Hubble sees, for the first time, the beginning stages of dust clumping into the pebbles that could eventually form rocky planets like Earth. But Orion's powerful central stars are burning away the gas around the planet-forming disks, maybe halting the formation of gas giant planets before it can begin. The eventual outcome of the planet survival drama in Orion could have far-reaching implications for the abundance of planets and life in our Milky Way galaxy.